Oh, it's a chicken. <laughs>
This is scary. If there's any spirits in here, please feel free to speak into our cameras. All right, guys. We're at the Plaza Tower. <laughs> 45 floors. You can see here behind me, the window's completely missing. I literally could just drop to my death right here. I'm here with my wife, All Things Paranormal Official. As always, please like, share, and subscribe, and don't hate, investigate. Let's get it, baby. Look, I'm gonna show y'all where I was. Which bridge is that, the Gino? As to see, we're in the murder capital of the United States, downtown New Orleans. So, you think it's fun to try to scare me? Am I doing your intro? <laughs> yes. You're on the edge. I'm sorry. I mean, I don't have my life insurance policy completely filled out yet. <laughs> like, I'm, I'm really sweaty. You know, when we get up the heights. I get hot and sweaty and nervous. Sounds delicious. I do. I get nervous. And for him to just be right there, you know. Can I go lay over it with the camera? No, it's already scary. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Where do you want to do a little session, baby? Okay. Still recording. Let's go see what this is. <laughs> you guys, if you're new to my channel or my wife's, um, we're trying just to do some haunted explore, you know, stuff that we haven't done here in New Orleans. So we'll do the big, big name stuff later. <laughs> wow, I want to go on this. Whoa. And it's funny how sound travels too. Like those windows are busted. But you figure the higher up you go. Oh my god, there's no rails on the side. I got the heebie jeans. <laughs> my wife wants me to sign a waiver to go hunt with her. <laughs> Oh my god. Okay, I'm sorry. I'll stop. <laughs> that was... It's pretty cool. Scary though. Hey you guys, this building's been abandoned since uh, Katrina hit. Katrina flooded. So, Fl Katrina? Katrina is the reason for this being flooded. Get your light back on. You want me to go first, just in case? Yeah, that way I can get her money, because I got one on her, too. <laughs> you multiply, like gremlins. Where? Yes. 
Excuse the jock strap on my face. <laughs> I, I let her borrow it. <laughs> I had it on. Because the bottom one had a Okay, wifey, we're getting our workout today. And we're going to go do that other place. We're going to have a workout. We're going to sleep good tonight. What does that say? For show. Oh, see, it's changing now that we go up. The other side over there is different. It's the same layout. Right, but. Oh no, I'll put my mask on. Right when I said, I heard, you know, like when you drop pebbles from the top floor down. Mm -hmm. That's what it sounded like. Serious? Hello? The guy that we ran into is all the way to the first floor. Is there any spirits here from Hurricane Katrina? I don't want to put my light in there because I don't want to drop it. What is this? Freddy Krueger room. Oh, look at that rope. Somebody made that to shimmy down something. Look at it, how it's braided like this. Wow. People do that. They'll come in here and scrap the old thing. Oh, the Freddy Krueger. Freddy Krueger broiler room. It's the broiler room. Come see. Just poke your head in here. It looks like the poltergeist mill in here. I bet you something happened in here. Yeah, there's a whole floor here. Hello? It's not scary, it's sturdy. I promise. There's some heroin needles. Come on, I. Babe, if this hasn't fell, I ain't gonna fall. Do you know how much this stuff weighs? Millions of pounds, I'm sure. No, we're fine. Come on. No, they're just. Are there any spirits in here from Katrina that would like to speak with us? Yep. Look at that knife. It's broke. This is what they come in scrap. Heroin needles. Sorry, guys, you're going to see that. Okay. Yep. All the metal they come in scrap. Thousands of dollars. Freddy Krueger boiler room, guys. Let's go see. Except these ones are way more sturdy. Seriously. Oh, this is really cool up here. Come on, baby. <laughs> okay, I got you. Come on. You're good, you're good. Just keep walking. Watch your head, watch your head, watch your head. Watch your head, watch your head. Okay, here. Yeah. See, look at this. Okay, guys. Let's see where we're at. Pretty cool, huh, guys? You can see downtown New Orleans right here behind us. We just keep discovering more and more stuff. So there's the GNO bridge right there that takes us home. Let's go see what else we can find. Woman, you over there acting scared. Look at you took on woman. Oh wow. 
Those dudes come. Three paranormal TV, baby. Look what I do for you. My wife is scared back here. <laughs> she doesn't want to come out here. So you can get an idea what we're doing here today. Hopefully, I'll fall through. Oh wow! Come see. This is incredible, you guys. Such a pretty view. You can see it right there. We're going to the plant of death. <laughs> Power plant of death. Let's go see what's on this side. We haven't been on. See those two towers right there sticking out? This is so amazing. Now you're here, or you can speak into our cameras. Trying to see if we can get any spirit communication, but it's kind of hard here. Um, it's kind of loud, and where did you out? We have the rim pod set in the middle hallway right here. We're going to show you in a second where the elevators are. We just want to see if we will get any traction from where people used to roam the halls, literally. Excuse the noise. It's still noisy out here on the 25th floor. I know, so surprising, right? It's weird how sound travels. Anyway, I'm losing cell phone service, so that's pretty interesting. Also, the higher up in the sky you go, less service you have, so let's go. Any Hurricane Katrina victims in this building? Please go up to the 25th floor and speak to us or set up our rim pod that's in the middle of this hallway, please. All you gotta do is touch the silver antenna. And if it's not Thank you. 
Yep. I'm gonna turn the EMF reader on and see if uh, we can get anything here too. I'm gonna walk around with it a little bit. The camera has a uh, straight gas alert. So I'm just gonna do a sweep, walk around, see if there's absolutely no electricity in here. See if we can pick up anything. And as you can see, I'll take you directly to the electrical boxes here. No power whatsoever. Just got really lightheaded. I don't know if it's from the building or what from. Hello, hello, any spirits, please feel free to come touch that little device in the middle of the elevators there. It will not harm you. Just lets us know you're here. I'm going to show you how it works. Just show you you will not get hurt. All you got to do is touch it. Come close to it and all it does is light up. It won't harm you. Any spirits at all, please come feel free to touch that light. I want to come back at night. <laughs> it's just really not much to see, but it'd be cool to explore all the way to the top. No, me either. We're just a quick haunted explore, guys. We're trying to see if we could catch anything, but I think we might wrap this one up. Yeah. So, what else going on? Just like to go through anything spooky and creepy and haunted, we got to try it. And go to the end of buildings that people would not want to go to or least expect to go to, right? So, if it's scary and it's spooky, <laughs> where are your guys, right? Where are your guys? Mm -hmm. yeah. we still mm -hmm. Definitely. Oh, all that noise. Well, it's almost city traffic time. So we're about to head out before it gets too, too noisy. All right, guys, we're wrapping this one up. Uh, not too much activity in here. It's more of a, a urbex explore, I guess, today, right? Yeah. Um, I thought I heard shuffling. I, I heard something. Too. Like it's about to come out the elevator. Now this building has been abandoned since Hurricane Katrina. A lot of people did pass away, but it doesn't mean that it's haunted. It doesn't also mean that there's spirits here. So, with that being said, please don't hate, investigate, 